was really a moment of happiness as uh, before that I felt twice a TOEFL test uh, even uh, with a high score of GMAT so you can imagine my feelings when I like get that acceptance letter to AA. Panic, then joy, then the relief after all the exam, then panic again. It was mixed emotions. First of all, I realized that I have to close one door and open another. And I thought, do I really need this? And then said, yes, let's go. Attitudes toward uh, the student. When I, uh, I recall that when I first uh, entered the university, on the very first day of studies, we were given a little brochure and uh, there was a picture of a student uh, standing in the middle, uh, surrounded by uh, some uh, emojis of uh, books, library, uh, professors, uh, etc. And everything was evolving around the student. And it, it showed to me that in this university I am the most important person. Uh, I can bring um, just simple example of uh, approach, uh, methodology of studying. It's basically problem-solving approach. We were used to classical form of studying and when we came to university it was mostly like you have a task and you have to solve it. Opportunities, knowledge and the most important hard work. Prospect, knowledge and achievement. Pride, professionalism, Status. Respect, uh, emotions, fun. Skills, quality, opportunities. Once we have a talk with our professor and joking about another one, and we were surprised that the professor told us that uh, the, another professor whom we are talking uh, was his wife. Uh, we were doing focus group discussions with women uh, to explore the um, attitude and knowledge to child feeding practices and during one of the focus group discussions no women showed up and we were really stressed. Students at that time thinking that we didn't fulfill our assignment and uh, weren't able to gather students. However, when we went to the professor who was leading this project and were kind of informing uh, her that, sorry, but nobody showed up, said, oh, but the food is still there, right? We can go and eat. Being a student in AUA, I worked for an Armenian software company, and we started a project with uh, US companies. When it was the first business trip there, suddenly I understood that nothing strange here is going. Whatever is going here, I already know from my university studies. I can note that I got three main skills from AUA that I use daily. It's ability to do research, communication skills and presentation skills. I see AUA in future as a research intensive university producing PhD students for Armenia. I would wish AUA to stay one of the leading universities in Armenia and in the region and would advise to interact more and to cooperate with the private sector, especially for MBA <coughs> programs. Because there are people with disabilities and maybe people who can't travel every day to AUA, maybe from regions of Armenia, I would like to see an online study possibility at AUA so children and uh, overall people from all over the Armenia will be able to study here. My advice to every AUA student and to my son who is an AUA student too to get good education because the, the education and the knowledge is the main reason for a good success, uh, future success. I would recommend current students to be themselves, to not get whatever is given by AUA as a dogma. Build network, use every single minute being in AUA to enrich, enhance their knowledge and skills. 
for their future. I will always remember that before a long break we were calling the guy who was working in the booth downstairs to prepare sandwiches for us so we can make it in time for the next class. I will always remember the years full of expectations, difficulties, uh, good memories and my friends. I will always remember AUA as it changed my mindset and helped me to get my dream job. Uh, I will always remember my course mates, my professors, and that there was no salt in cafeteria because uh, Armenian was the president of AUA and he was the head of public health program. I will always remember uh, Professor Harutun Armenian uh, and his saying, uh, mind is like parachute, it works well when it is open. I will always remember the time spent at AUA because it makes the globe closer to me.